Hi friends, welcome back to Arc Tutorials. This is JavaScript interview question answer series. Today's question is, explain what you mean by array.shift method. If you remember in the previous episode, we talked about array.pop where it removes the last element from the end of the array, right? So array.shift is just opposite of it, which means it removes the first element from the beginning of the array. These are something that if if they ask you one, understand that they'll probably ask you about the other. So remember, whenever you talk about shift, they'll probably ask you about pop as well. So pop and shift, think of it this way that pop will remove from the end of the array, the last element. Shift will remove the first element from the beginning of the array, right? Simple. Again, when you remove a particular element from an array, the length of the array goes down. And once it has removed, it will return you the array that was removed, right? So let's see this in action quickly. Okay, so last time we saw the pop. I'll keep this here to show you the difference between pop and shift both, right? So we have an array. Uh, let me first show you with shift and then I'll probably add pop to it. All right, so we have console.log. You do students dot uh, length when you do length of course you'll get four because we are not doing any operation but now we are doing shift and what does shift do it will remove the first element at the beginning of the array right so when you do this it should give us 10 let's see that so you see 10 because it removed the first element at the beginning of the array right now similarly when you do console.log now when you do students dot pop what happens? It will remove the last element, which is 23. So our expected output in this case is 10 and 23. So 10 and 23, right? I hope uh, this array methods uh, is clear to you because these are something which are mostly asked questions in your interviews. So make sure that you study, you prepare, you try this hands on and prepare well. Thank you so much for joining. I'll keep bringing you more questions to help you prepare for your interviews. Thank you so much for joining. Keep learning. Keep growing.